Three weeks ago, I posted a short film on my second channel and received hundreds of comments asking how I maintained such consistent character designs throughout my story. Most people assumed I hired a professional artist or spent years perfecting my drawing skills. The truth is, I used a completely free hey hi that generates realistic characters and scenes for my story. Look at this. Same person. Same face. Same personality. Different scenes. Take a look at this one also. No matter the scene background, no matter the action, and no matter the pose, the characters remain identical in every image. In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how I did it, so you can create your own amazing characters without spending a penny. If you are sick of spending hours or cash on character design for your project, this video is for you. Make sure you watch the video till the end because I will show you the secret hack you've been missing to build cohesive characters for your stories, games, or brand without spending a dime. Before we start, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this. Let's begin. The first step is to create a perfect character profile for any project you are going to create. Note, if you skip this step, your character won't stay consistent because this is the vital area in creating consistent character for your story. Before generating any images, we need to define the look of our character. To do this, we are going to be using ChatGPT for that. Head over to ChatGPT and type this prompt. Write a detailed prompt for generating an AI image of a realistic character named Olivia with a standard pose. This prompt will make ChatGPT to understand what we want from the prompt. Make sure you are specific of what you want the AI to do for you, and not so much that it becomes overwhelming, because detailed instruction is required in order to generate the best result. Click on Generate to see what ChatGPT will generate for us. This is the result from ChatGPT. It generates a detailed profile of the character we want, a highly detailed realistic portrait of Olivia, a young woman with a warm and confident expression. It also provides other features for the character, like facial features, clothing style, appearance, and personality traits. This result shows that we can keep using the prompt anytime we want to work with the Olivia scene in our story. Now that we have the prompt, let's move on to the next stage, where we are going to generate our character. Copy the entire prompt from ChatGPT and head over to Google ImageFX. I will provide the link for you in the description below. Once you are ImageFX, FX, the interface will look like this. After paste the prompt we generated from ChatGPT in the prompt input field below. Before we'll click on create, we will do some settings and add some few key elements to the prompt. Click on the elements below and choose elements that fit your image or click on more to explore more elements like ultra realistic, photo realistic, high contrast, and highly detailed. You can type those elements within your prompt yourself or ask ChatGPT to do that for you. The extra elements will make our character look more professional and stay consistent all through our image generation. Without them, ImageFX might generate something inconsistent or too generic. Set the aspect ratio and after, click on create. Wait a few seconds to get the result. Here is the result. Olivia is generated. You can see that the character looks the same in all the images. This looks very amazing. In order for the character to remain consistent in all the future images, we need to take another step. Click on the icon below. It will open to see other features. Do you see the lock icon? In the seed section, click it. It, it will lock the seed number. This is the hack to ensure that the character remains consistent in all our image generation. The seed feature will keep the character's facial feature and make it consistent in all the future images. Without what we did just now, your next image might look completely different, even if the prompt is the same. Now that we have locked the seed number, let's test if the method keeps the character consistent. Even if we change the background, scene, action, and pose. First, let's ask ChatGPT to generate a scene description for us. I write, describe a scene where Olivia sits in a restaurant. Then I click on generate. ChatGPT will generate a full description of Olivia sitting in a restaurant for us. I copy the entire prompt and paste into ImageFX, but make sure you do not remove Olivia profile prompt. We only change the scene description to a new one. The seed feature remains locked. Click on create. Look at it. This is amazing. Is still Olivia. The same face, same feature, just in a different location. This shows the seed lock feature is working. Let's try another one. We are going to ask ChatGPT for another scene again. Go back to ChatGPT. Describe a scene where Olivia sits in an office. Click on Generate. Here is the prompt. Copy the entire prompt and to Olivia Profile Prompt 
locked in the prompt box. The seed feature remains locked and the profile prompt remains the same except the new location prompt. Click on create. This is the result. The characters remain the same. Just a new location. The tool maintains her identity. Let's try one more. Ask ChatGPT to describe the scene where Olivia stands beside the car. Click on generate. ChatGPT will generate a full scene description for us. Copy the prompt and paste in the prompt to Olivia profile prompt in ImageFX. The seed feature remains locked. Click on create. This is the result. So amazing. Olivia remains the same across all the images. This shows that the ImageFX seed feature is working very well. It ensures that your character remains identical across all your future images. Now that we have a consistent character, let's use our character for a story and see how it looks. To do this, we need a story idea and short narrative focus on Olivia. We will be using ChatGPT for this also. I type, create a short story about Olivia, a young model discovering her passion. Click on generate. ChatGPT will generate the result for us. This is the result of the story from the AI in order to bring the story to life. We need to break down the story into scenes. Let's ask ChatGPT to do that for us. I ask ChatGPT to identify key scenes in this story that would make great illustrations. The AI tool has broke down the story into different scenes for us. Now let's begin with the first scene. Copy the first scene and paste into Olivia profile prompt. The point is to keep the character intact while the scene changes. Make sure the seed feature is locked. After, click on create. This is amazing. The character is in another scene entirely. Her face and identity remain the same. Let's create the second scene. Copy the second prompt from ChatGPT and paste to Olivia profile prompt in ImageFX. After, click on create. Here it is. We have the same Olivia in another scene. Copy the third scene from ChatGPT and follow the same process. Keep the original character profile prompt. Add a new scene description and the seed number remains locked. Click on create. The character remains consistent no matter the action or the scene description. This is the power of ImageFX seed feature. Whether you are a content creator creating short films, 3D animation, or creating content for social media like TikTok, Facebook, and others. This tool is for you. It will help you create an entire visual narrative and make your character consistent throughout the story. With ImageFX, you can create consistent characters throughout your story for free without paying a monthly subscription plan. If you enjoy this tutorial, make sure you like and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tutorials like this. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.